course of three additional tenses which can be used to express the future. As in our first example sentence here, this is the going to future. I'm going to play tennis tomorrow. The going to future has the structure subject plus the verb to be in the present tense, am, is or are, plus going, plus to, plus the verb in the base form. I am going to play. The going to future, unlike the future simple, is used to express plans or intentions, things that have already been decided before the moment of speaking. The going to future is also used for predictions. Whereas the future simple used predictions without evidence, the going to future is used for predictions with evidence. For example, I can see a big black cloud overhead, I have some evidence, therefore I can make my prediction, it's going to rain. We can also use the present continuous for the future. Here we see, I am seeing the doctor tomorrow. This is just a normal present continuous structure that we've seen before. Subject plus verb to be in the present tense, plus verb with ing at the end. The present continuous tense for the future is used for future arrangements. Things that you'd put in your planners, diaries or journals. The final tense that we use for the future is the present simple such as in our example sentence, the train leaves at 6 p.m. The present simple here is being used with a future meaning and it's used for scheduled or timetabled events.